So this here is a squeeze plate press. I think that's what it's called. Anyways, that's what I call it. This is great for working the uh, inner portion of the of the pecs um, because you really have to squeeze hard in order to hold the weight and keep it from dropping on you. So I'll demonstrate with the lighter weight first so I don't hurt myself. But basically you just take a, a plate and in order to get the best squeeze out of this, you want to use your palms to hold the weight. I would recommend using your whole hand at first until you are sure that you can actually hold that weight. Um, but if you use your palms, then it allows you to engage more of the squeezing action. So you can see the palm versus if I just touch my fingertips together, then it's a whole lot easier for me to hold the weight. And you're not really taking advantage of that um, squeezing contraction. So. Um, just demonstrating with the with the lightweight here, just my the palms of my hands are squeezing this together so it doesn't fall on me. Again, for the first time, make sure you just hold the weight so you can actually know what it feels like. But really, you're just going to press upward, squeezing the entire time as hard as you can, almost like you're trying to break the weight between your hands. I guarantee, if you do that, you're going to feel it even with the lightest weight. So there's one option. To make it more challenging, you can take two weights. Usually five to 10 pounds is plenty. What makes this more difficult is that you have to squeeze these two weights together uh, even harder to get a better inner chest contraction. You gotta prevent them from sliding. It's a whole lot easier if you're using rubber weights so be careful if you're using anything that's more of the iron side. And then if that's uh, not enough for you, then you can use a full plate. Uh, but just keep in mind, um, while it is more weight, it doesn't necessarily mean a better exercise um, because you're more likely to use your fingertips to hold the weight rather than the inside of your, of your palms. So. <clears throat> first time you do these I would recommend doing them at an incline rather than a flat bench and then if these get to be too easy for you obviously keep going up in the weight try to hold together 210s 220s but you can also do these just going straight forward which gives you a good shoulder workout at the same time I think it's good to mix these up, but be very careful when you try this exercise. You don't want to drop this right on your sternum and crack it, so I'm not liable if you do that to yourself.